Hi, my name is Tim Gilwa. I'm the CEO of the Lynx India. So, what is the Lynx? What do we do? Uh, basically, our job is to create value for our clients. So, we are not an advertising agency. We are not a PR agency. We are not a social media agency. We are not a media agency. Our job is just to create value for our client. So, how are we organized? Basically, we have two business lines. One business line is strategy. It's strategy like, it's not strategy like Bain, McKinsey, IT Kearney, etc. It's more about marketing strategy. And in this marketing strategy, we have one killer product which has been developed in France and very successful for the last three years, which is called the Customer Journey Strategy. So what is a Customer Journey Strategy? Basically, uh, I can give you an example, which could be a pinball game. So the customer or the consumer is the ball and is going to be triggered by something. And then he will realize that he will needs to take some information to compare the product, to discuss with people. So like, like an, on a pinball, lots of interaction, lots of media interaction, lots of contact, point of contact interaction. So that after different uh, scene, like on TV, like discussion with some friends, like uh, uh, going into a shop, etc., seeing a billboard, going on blogs, etc., on Facebook, he will realize that he needs this product and then he will buy it, and then he might become an ambassador of it. So the objective of this is to understand the customer behavior and to be able not to be blind anymore, to know who are you talking to, what is their behavior, and most important, in what point of contact you should invest. Because actually, what you have to know is that 80% of the budget, most of the time, of the marketing budget goes into media. So you'd better know what is the best media to invest in and to be able to know where to invest. So um, basically, uh, this customer journey will help you to know who are your customer and you'll be able to talk to the right person at the right moment with the right message of creativity and with the right tone. So that's our first business line. Our second business line is about operation. So we recently acquired Salt Mango Tree, a very great company in Kerala, based in Cochin and in Delhi. And basically, Salt Mango Tree is becoming our creative arms of our operation in India. So what do, we, what do we propose? As any great creative agency, we propose some logo, we propose branding, we propose social media, we propose printing, we propose packaging, everything regarding to creativity and these two jobs are together in the same entity which is called the Lynx India. The objective in the future is very simple. What we've done in France is that we are specialized in bank and in finance. So we want to export this knowledge and this expertise in the Indian market because we know how it's going to be. So we will need to adapt it but it's going to be very interesting for the bank and finance brand in our industry. Plus, the health sector is as well a priority because we have the knowledge, uh, thanks to Salt Mango Tree, who is already a good actor in marketing in the health industry. So, uh, why, why are we in India? I think our company by DNA is, going, is already now an Indian-French company. What does it mean? It means we are going to bring the structure of the Euro European country and the professionalism. But at the same time, we are going to take all the great culture of Indian, especially regarding creativity. That's why we have brought uh, in the Kerala and Delhi Salt Mango Tree. So basically, we are going to propose you the best of the, of the two worlds, which is a fantastic mix between structure and creativity and methodology. What is our unique value proposition? That we are value creator and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you very much.